We respectfully acknowledge that Wood Buffalo Regional Library is situated on Treaty 8 territory, the traditional lands of the Cree and Dene First Nations and Métis Nation. I'm Shauna from Reference Services, and welcome back to Book Bites, a video series from Wood Buffalo Regional Library where we give you a sneak peek of our collections. Many of us have been itching for a vacation because of the travel restrictions with the pandemic. So today we're going to explore titles from our junior collection that help you to travel through a book. First off, Lonely Planet Kids presents Love Around the World, Family and Friendship Across the Globe, with words by Ali Bryden and pictures by Waza Pink. This beautiful picture book shows how family and friendship are celebrated across the globe. For example, take a look at this page. In Japan, love is a lunchbox. Obento, the Japanese word for lunchbox, is a way for the lunch maker to communicate their love with the lunch eater. Check out this super cool true story, Girl on a Motorcycle, by Amy Novesky and illustrated by Julie Morstadt. This one follows the real-life journey of the first woman to ride a motorcycle around the world alone. She sees many beautiful sights, experiences many wonderful things, and she also has her fair share of flat tires and falls, but she never fails to get back up and keep on riding. In All the Way to Havana by Margarita Engel, a boy and his parents drive to Havana, Cuba, taking in the sights and sounds. The illustrations by Mike Corrado are so beautiful and detailed you'll feel like you're driving through the streets of Havana too, where people lean over crumbling balconies as laundry dances and a sea breeze sings. Molly and May takes us on a journey by train, where two friends, Molly and May, enjoy the various thrills of traveling by rail as well as the highs and lows of their friendship. This charming tale by Danny Parker and Freya Blackwood reminds us that when things get bumpy between friends, it's good to pause, reflect, and then get back on track. Finally, if you're looking for something a bit more factual for young readers, there's the Let's Explore series by Boomba Books. This one, Let's Explore Japan by Walt K. Moon, features gorgeous photographs from around Japan with information and questions to reflect on. Here's an example page. Japan has four main islands. Mountains cover the land. Most people live near the sea. Why do you think most people live near the sea? Thanks for joining me on this session of Book Bites. If you could travel anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? Let us know in the comments below. And happy reading!